What are you most excited to see at the zoo today? Polar bears and panda. I Baby hippo? Yeah! and we're still having a sock issue. Somehow the socks didn't make it into the bags, so now we're like checking all the bags. The exact thing I didn't want to happen. try the Stingray Bay, but apparently that doesn't open until 10, and it costs extra years to purchase tickets up there. So we're not gonna do that today, so we're gonna move on. What's that? What the heck is this? Mm -hmm. Jaden! Look at this guy. What is he? Look at his mouth. If you wanna see God's creativity, see what? from like all over, all these different windows. started 10 minutes early, so we missed a little bit of the front, first part of it. So there's like 200 different species of bamboo, but they only eat like four different kinds of it, so it's really hard for them to find the particular kind they like. Wow. How many did they eat a day? How uh, many pounds? Yeah. How many pounds? Like six? six. Or, no, it was like 40. 40. Where'd we get six? 40 Where's pounds of bamboo. Recipe? That's a lot of bamboo. So strange. So it's perfect. 78 versus 110 degrees in Texas. <laughs> Whoa. Why can't we hold hands? Because it's not appropriate. It's not appropriate. Yes. But we're That's married. What you always tell me. But we're married. He doesn't want us holding hands. That's mean. Uh, how cute is that? So cute! What do y'all think about panda? What? How do you say that? What? Funnel fries? Whoa, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Dump it on there, man. <laughs> Thanks, man, appreciate it. 
Look at all that powdered sugar. How is that a polar bear? A black bear. Polar bear. That's a black bear. Yeah, how is that a polar bear? Where's the polar part? So we found the polar bear over here in the black bear exhibit. And I'm sure there's a reason, but I don't know why. So one thing that we've really noticed is that they have a lot of places to sit and eat. Um, like this place here has a ton of picnic tables. And a lot of other zoos we've been to, I feel like it's kind of hard unless you're purchasing food and sitting inside somewhere. So that's really cool. About making it like visible to the people, but also like I'm hot, I'm hot, clear I'm habitat. Hot. I'm pushing my mom in the stroller, and it says D A N G E R, shortcut to the giraffe. Let's go. I learned that on Inside Out. He was complaining because I was pushing Zoe and Jonah, and he wanted to have a turn too. And he's like, It's not fair. I'm like, You know what's not fair? I haven't had a turn yet. So there you are. Aw, oh, you can't feed the giraffes. They're sold out. Okay, we'll keep going forward. We'll see the giraffes, the regular giraffes. The ones that don't need to be fed. How relaxing is this? I feel like this would never happen in the forward zoo, especially not during the summer. There's like barely anybody in here. We're just chilling, watching the hippos sleep. <laughs> Is that what he's doing, Jaden? Yeah. You know what he's doing? Um, okay. Are you ready for the show to start? So we just went to the sea lion show, and it was pretty. It was pretty cool. If they like trained them, like to feed. Like that's what we're seeing. Like them training. <coughs> There's a ball that they can have to touch with their nose. How how high is the ball in the water? Maybe 10, 10 feet. At least maybe t maybe ten feet. It was kind of cool. We left the zoo starving and so we came to Central Barbecue that's apparently super famous. So we got some brisket, green beans, regular beans, more regular beans, potato salad, some barbecue sauce. This is <gasps> freaking amazing. I want that. You don't even know what that is. Whatever it is, I want it. <laughs> okay. Yeah.
house and I just wanted to give a brief recap of the Memphis Zoo. I was actually really impressed with it. I thought it was really well put together, really well laid out. The animals seemed really well taken care of. Of course, there was a lot about conservation. As far as the enclosures go, they were really extravagantly detailed. I thought that was really neat. Um, to be able to walk around the animals, that was different because a lot of zoos we've been to, you can see it from one side, but you can't really see the backside. So we certainly appreciate the Memphis Zoo working with us and um, sponsoring the, the day for us because it was a really great experience. Um, and we definitely would recommend it to people coming through Memphis. Um, as far as the barbecue goes, and the barbecue was delicious. So. I highly recommend uh, Central Barbecue in Memphis if you're coming through. Uh, First of all, what was your favorite part of the zoo? Uh, the pandas, the aquarium, the glow up jellyfish. Okay. That that was my favorite, but the other stuff was the other stuff was kind of cool too. I was working for a panda. Oh, the panda bear. Yeah. The panda was your favorite. Yeah. What'd you guys think of the barbecue? It was awesome. <laughs> it was. Dynamite. Dynamite? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> That's it.